Many believe vehicles that communicate with each other are part of this industry's future, but they could become the norm, and soon, when the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration makes a key ruling in 2013. Our Aaron O'Connor picks up the story from there. Connected vehicle technology is about to see some serious street time. Every other car that's equipped with this radio can hear your, your data, your location, your speed, your direction, which way you're moving, and then um, receive that data and assess whether um, there's a possible hazardous situation between cars. The systems, known as V2X, let equipped vehicles communicate with traffic lights and each other to prevent accidents, improve fuel economy, and even avoid red lights using GPS and Wi-Fi-like signals. We've seen this technology before in systems like Ford's Smart Intersection and BMW's car to x But now, automakers and suppliers are working on a deadline from NHTSA. 2013, we want, to, we want to have enough information to make the decision whether we're going to move forward, whether it's regulation, whether it's part of NCAP, or whether we need more research, actually. A test drive hosted by supplier Denso this week showed just how effective at crash prevention the technology can be. And NHTSA says the systems could address up to 82% of accidents with unimpaired drivers. The next big step? Deploying V2X in a to-be-determined city sometime next year. For Auto News Now, I'm Erin O'Connor. Berg also points out that if mandated, V2X systems can be retrofitted into older vehicles.